Hello class. Welcome to our fourth lesson. In our last lesson, we talked about what? The structure of animals. We talked about animals which live in a house, in the forest, and in the water. And we also said animals which live in our homes are called domestic animals. And examples of these animals are dog, cat, hen. And we also talked about animals that live in the forest. They are called what? Wild animals. And examples of these animals are what? Tiger, lion, cheetah, hyena. All these animals are wild animals. And we also talked about aquatic animals. You see, aquatic animals are animals which live in water. And we gave examples like shark, dolphin, tilapia, and so on. Today we are going to talk about the basic structure of animals. All animals have different body parts. However, the basic body parts of all animals are they have the head, the legs, and the trunk. These are the three main words, body parts of all animals. The head, the legs, and the trunk. The trunk is the body. And the limbs are the hands and the legs of what? Animals. But today we are only going to talk about the limbs. We'll be talking about the trunk and the head in the other lesson. So this is an example of an animal. This is a cow. This is the head, the trunk, and the limbs. The head, the trunk, and the limbs. Today we are going to talk about the limbs of what? Animals. We are going to talk about the limbs of animals. Limb refers to the hands and legs of animal. I already said that. It refers to the hands and legs of animal. Limbs help animals move. Without their legs and their hands, they will not be able to move from one place to another. Some animals have two limbs, others have four limbs, and others also have about six limbs and so on. So now, bears have two limbs. We all know bears have two limbs. Examples of these bears are we have what? Hen, crow, parrot, and sparrow. They all have two limbs. Then mammals. Mammals are animals which give birth to their own kind. They give birth to their own kind. Example, cat, dog, lion. They give birth to their own kind. Even as human beings, we are mammals. Mammals have four limbs. They have four limbs that they use to move from one place to another. Examples of these mammals are we have what? Dog, cat, goat, lion, sheep. All these animals have four limbs. Now we move to what? Insects. Some insects have six what? Limbs. Examples of insects that have six limbs. We have what? Mosquito and the butterfly. But for the spider, the spider has what? Eight limbs. The spider has eight limbs. So today we talk about the limbs of animals. In our next lesson, we are going to talk about the head and the trunk of animals. Below the video, there is an exercise there. So try and do it and snap a picture of it and send it to my WhatsApp number. Thank you very much. Bye-bye.